Between September and October 2024, the European Manned Unmanned System for Helicopter Musher project marked a significant advancement in military operations by successfully validating in-flight interoperability between helicopters and drones. Conducted from Isle du Levant in France and various locations in Italy, these tests represent a major leap forward for European military missions, showcasing the feasibility of remotely controlling drones via satellite communication. Led by France in collaboration with Italy, Spain and Belgium, the Musher project aims to integrate new capabilities into the armed forces through the development and validation of technologies that facilitate cooperation between manned and unmanned platforms. Co-managed by the French Defense Innovation Agency, AID, and the French Defense Procurement Agency, Missile Testing, DGAM, the project includes contributions from the 3D Action Management Unit, DGA Engineering and Projects, and DGAM. The testing campaign was meticulously orchestrated, involving preparatory work that led to the development of an innovative communication system capable of effectively linking various aircraft during joint missions. The tests unfolded in multiple phases, first conducting operations separately and then simultaneously. The DGAM site on Isle du Levant served as one of the primary bases, along with another facility in southern Italy. For the French component of the trials, an H-130 helicopter outfitted with specific sensors was paired with a VSR-700 drone developed by Airbus Helicopters. Meanwhile in Italy, a helicopter from Leonardo was linked with an SW-4 Solo, a hybrid aircraft that can be piloted manually or operated autonomously through a drone interface. Both test sites and aircraft were interconnected via satellite communication, ensuring real-time data exchange and control over long distances. The flight demonstration on October 9, 2024, served as a highlight of the Musher project, marking a decisive step toward interoperability. In attendance was a representative from the European Commission, who witnessed the progressive levels of interaction achieved between helicopters and drones. The event culminated in a remarkable demonstration where a drone operated from one country was effectively controlled by a helicopter stationed 1,000 kilometers away, validating the feasibility of joint operations within the European Union. These successful tests opened the door to new capabilities for next-generation helicopters, particularly the upgraded Gepard and Tiger models, which will be equipped to collaborate with drones in future military missions. The integration of unmanned platforms is set to significantly enhance the range and effectiveness of operations, providing armed forces with an invaluable strategic asset. The Musher testing campaign represents a notable advancement in military aerospace, paving the way for more integrated manned and unmanned systems in European air operations. The progress achieved through this initiative not only underscores technological advancements, but also highlights the commitment to enhancing cooperation among European nations for a unified defense strategy, laying the groundwork for the future of interoperable air systems.